What's going on guys, Bazzi here. Welcome back to the grind of trying to find a lobby where I actually have a floor bar. I literally cannot find a game of free for all at all. And all I can find in Team Deathmatch is American lobbies, which does not help when I'm Australian. Like, I hate being negative about the game because it always makes me play worse and I just hate being negative. But this is fucking bullshit. 45% of players in this playlist and I can't find a fucking local lobby. If this lobby is American, I'm actually going to lose my fucking shit, man. You have no clue. Look at it, man. Three Americans pull host over nine other Australians. I, I don't understand it. Well, fix your fucking servers wasn't my ideal topic for this commentary, but, you know, you're just going to have to do. Fuck! Dude. This gun is so good, this ICR, man. This accuracy on it is actually insane. You guys would have seen in my previous video, my stats update, and me getting first prestige. You would have actually seen how many games I've actually played. Simply just because I've had to back out of so many, you know. Not that I want to care about my combat record too much, but you know, it is kind of upsetting that, you know, I, I want it to look half decent. And the fact that I have to have such a bad win loss simply because I cannot find an Australian lobby, it just gets to me. This does seem to be a common problem on my friends list. If you guys are having the same problem, please be sure to leave a comment down below. I'd be very interested to see if everyone's getting it. It has only actually been with Nuketown, but this morning when I tried to play free for all so I could do this cut commentary, I found out it was in free for all now as well. Like, dude, I don't give a fuck if I have to play gun game to be on a four bar connection. I'll fucking do it. There is absolutely no reason why I should be in a lobby this bad, you know? It's, it's almost midday, so enough people should be on. I just don't understand it at all how how hard can it be you know we've been wanting dedicated service for three years we've been getting told we'll get it where the fuck are they something that really got my attention today was xbox one is bringing back reverse capability that is not how you say that capable i'm not even going to try and say it man i'm too tired i've been on the grind for way too long like i went to the midnight release played a tiny bit that night and then I had a mate's 19th all weekend, so I haven't really been playing until Sunday night and all of Monday. Which is rare for me. Any other cotter would have been about 3rd or 4th prestige by now. But then taking into consideration how long this game does take to level up, I don't think I'd be much higher than what I am now. But yes, back on topic, Black Ops 1 coming back to the Xbox One. You know, that is the game I started all on. You know, I would, I would love to play that game again. If this is actually true and closer to the release date, which is set to be December, PS4 has said nothing about bringing back Black Ops 1, making the Switch is something that I'll definitely think about. Black Ops 1 was just that game I, I could never get sick of, man. Like, I could literally sit there for hours on end, man. I, I could throw the all-nighter and, y you know, you you're still interested in playing. You're not fucking going to bed because of that fucking hit, Red J. So, yeah, I would... Definitely, definitely, definitely be making a video about this Black Ops 1 once I read up about it and get more news on it. I know there's something like 400 or so games. It may not be that many, it may be a bit more. I can't remember the exact amount, but I think it's around there. Another game that did actually catch my attention would definitely be Skate 3. You know, that game is a blast to play. So much fun. I'm probably going to stay away from cut commentaries until this server problem is fixed. You know, it's just going to be too difficult. I I upload cut comments basically for the commentary, but you know, no one likes to see me going negative and seeing that sort of poor gameplay. Thanks guys, that's going to wrap it up right there. Please be sure to leave a like and comment if you guys did enjoy the video, and always be sure to drop a subscription if you are new to my channel. Thanks as always, and until next time, bye.